a clock manufacturing company decided the price with 25% profit on the cost price. Okay, so what does it mean? The sentence means that a company is manufacturing clock and they decide that uh, the price of the clock would be with a 25% profit. And by selling the clock at 8% discount, the company has a profit of 300 rupees. Find the cost price of the watch. So let us start like this. So let the cost price, let the CP, CP stand for cost price, cost price. So let the cost price be 100. Okay. Now what is doing is they're adding a 25% profit. So profit uh, is 25% of cost price. So 25% of 100 is 25. So you can see the printed price. Okay, the, this is the printed price or the tag price. Uh, the, the price which is on the clock is 100 plus 25, which is 125 rupees. Now what they're doing is, okay, they are now selling it. So as salespeople, they would say, well, we are uh, giving you a discount of 8%. Now what's the discount? So let's write discount. Discount they are giving 8%. So even after giving 8% discount they are having a profit. So what's the actual selling price? So actual selling price. Selling price would be 125 minus 8% of 125 rupees. 8% of 125 rupees. So my pen is playing up. So let us find, I don't want to use a calculator. I want to do without a calculator. So let me show you how people calculate in a, a percent. So I want to find 8% of 125 rupees so well one percent is one hundredth of this so it is 1.25 so what will be two percent two percent would be double of this which is two dollar or two two point five zero rupees and ten percent is one tenth of this okay so ten percent is twelve twelve point five zero Okay, 12 rupees 50 paise. So, uh, so from this, 10% uh, take away 2%. So I can say 8% is 10% take away 2%. So that is 12, 12.5 take away 2.5. So it is 10 rupees. This is how you can do. You can do in different ways. This is how I would do if I didn't have a calculator. So this is 125 take away. 10 so the actual selling price is 115 so what's the cost price the cost price is 100 and the actual selling price is 115 so what's the profit now so the profit is the cost price was 100 the actual selling price is 115 so the profit is 115 take away 100 so the actual profit is 15 rupees okay so now let us make up a table or let me let us write this as a proportion so can I say so let us write profit here and we want to find the cost price okay so let us make up a table so I can say when the profit is 15 when the profit is 15 the cost price is 100 so now the question is if the cost if the profit is 300 what is the cost price this is the actual cost price so let us think in a proportional manner so this so I can say let us let me do without the calculator so uh, this is for 15 times what gives you 300 so well 15 times 2 is 30 so 15 times 20 is 300 so let me write this as say X or uh, let us write this as say C, C for cost price. So 15 times 20 is 300. So this C 
you have to also or this 100 has to be multiplied by 20 to maintain the proportion so in other words c which is the cost price is 100 times 20 so you can see that the actual cost price was 2000 rupees the actual cost price was 2000 so let us go back and check whether the answer that we have got is right so the cost price is 2000 rupees okay and uh, what is the profit so yeah they are adding profit of 25 percent uh, so 25 percent is a quarter of this so half of this is uh, profit is 25 percent so 25 percent is a quarter of this so half of this is 1000 so 25 percent is 500 rupees okay and uh, the printed price of the clock was 2500 now they're giving a discount of eight percent what they're saying is they're giving a discount of eight percent so let us find eight percent of 2500 okay so 10 percent is one tenth which is 250 so one percent is 100 uh, 100 which is 25 so 2 percent would be 50 so you take away 2 percent uh, this is to if you take away 250 sorry uh, 50 from this so you can say this is 8 percent would be 200 rupees 8 percent is 200 so from this from the price if you take away so you can see the selling price the actual selling price is 2500 minus 200 which is rupees 2300 and there you can see the profit of 300 because the cost price was 2000 and the selling price actual selling price is 2300 so you can see there's a profit of 300 rupees this is how you can work out examples of prof uh, profit and loss.